Uh, my name is John Cashman. I'm here with my uh, Ford T25 here today, and I'm attending the McGeeley Vintage Club Working Day here in uh, a lovely sunny Cork. Um, uh, I've got the T25. I've had it for about three years, and uh, as you can see, she's in excellent condition. It was an uh, English import. I think came into the country via KTC Tractors in Carlow, and then uh, was bought by uh, Cullum Leonard, who up in Dublin, and who I bought it from. And uh, at the time, I was looking for a TW35 because um, it was a tractor that I was grew up with. It was an iconic tractor back in the 90s when I was a, a schoolboy, and uh, obviously there's a big, uh, big interest in the tractors nowadays. And, uh, and so I was looking for a TW35, and uh, there was none available. And this T TW25 came up in Dublin, and it was absolutely in fabulous condition. It had some uh, uh, embellishments made to it. It had uh, solid front rims fitted to it, and it had all new tyres fitted all the way around and uh, had, uh, had a paint job as well, so it was all in excellent condition. The, the key feature that I was interested in looking for was uh, the cab in, in good condition because I used that as a sign to guide me as to whether the tractor's been well looked after. And the cab in this tractor is, is in excellent condition for its age. All the paddock is intact, the seat's in good condition, and, uh, and it was obviously well looked after um, you know, in its earlier life. So um, we did a deal on the tractor and uh, I bought it and uh, was, it was the second tractor in my collection, another Ford, and, uh, and obviously then I set about uh, getting involved in the classic scene. I didn't quite realise at the time that there was such a big following for classic tractors in the area, uh, or across the UK and Ireland, and, uh, and obviously once I got involved and I, I bought myself a silage harvester to go on the back of the tractor, all these amazing events suddenly popped out the woodwork that I could attend and, uh, and go with and, and meet new people. and. And, uh, and obviously discuss and, uh, and make uh, new friends involved with the classic tractors. The, the tractor itself is, is uh, the very last of the four TWs. Um, it's a 19, 1988 model, uh, D-Reg, Dublin Reg, and uh, it's obviously got the black lights as you can see along the front there. Right, so the, the, the TW35 is a range topper. Uh, back in the 1980s of these fantastic four tractors. The TW25 was the second model down and it replaced the TW20, um, obviously with a longer nose and um, another fuel tank. But the, 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 the main benefit of this tractor was its versatility because it had a two-speed PTO, which the TW35 didn't have. Um, and okay, well, it didn't have the power, the same power level, it was much more of a versatile tractor. So some people um, complain about Fords, uh, they've obviously had renowned for problems with porous engines and obviously the crash box in this tractor is not to everyone's cup of tea, but uh, I love this tractor, it's absolutely a fantastic machine, it looks fabulous and it, as long as you look after them, they last forever.